hand, you can just about find a break in it with. Then again, you can know someone all their life, but might not know their friend, unless you see them at night, cause. Say what, man? The three days of darkness is as mysterious as it is deadly. Billions will die in just 72 hours. In the other three days of darkness video, I suggested a few causes for the high death rate. Three more theories has come to my attention since the first video. The first of these prophecies come from the Hopi tribe of the Southwest, United States. And the Hopi lived in the Southwest for thousands of years. The Hopi has a long tradition of prophecy. They uh, are very secretive. The Hopi discovered many, many secrets involving the future. Much like the Mayans with whom the Hopis traded and lived, uh, they believed in the cycles of the world. The first world was destroyed by fire. The second world was destroyed by ice. A flood destroyed the third. We are now in the fourth world. Earthquakes, floods, and hailstorms will mark the end of the fourth world, and the fifth will be ushered in by three days of darkness, unless we return to the zigzag way. The Hopi believes that three days of darkness will be extremely difficult for people. People are to gather together and pray. According to Hopi prophecy, we can make it together but we must return to our roots change everything even social structure ancient man can survive um, these uh, trials but modern man they'll die it is also said that they will be uh, that they will move we will move into the fourth dimension according to Nostradamus on the other hand a gigantic asteroid will hit the earth in 2026, the world will be covered in darkness for three days as a result. All man-made structures will be destroyed. So, stay indoors, guys. <laughs> um, and all evil will be purged. What evil will, or are they talking about? The evil effects of urban life on the natural world or people that they just don't agree with? Uh, with the mainstream way of thinking. This may relate to Project Blue Beam also. Ultimately, to the devil and his fallen angels coming down under the guise of aliens. Two out of three uh, people will die as a result. That's what the traditions of men say. What does the word say? Joel uh, 2, 28 through 32 says that uh, 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 he will pour out his God will pour out his spirit and that the sun will turn into darkness and the moon into blood. Verse 32 says that those who call upon the name of the Lord will be delivered. Isaiah, Amos, Ecclesiastes, Hosea all talk about people being delivered from evil by God. The Quran speaks of sinkholes collapsing in various places and a fog descending for about 40 days. Muslims will suffer cold-like symptoms and non-Muslims will lay unconscious. Then the world will be covered in darkness for three days. The Dan al Hart will appear during the three days of darkness after a shift in the Earth's act axis of rotation. Whatever happens during the three days of darkness, the factor that will spell life or death is not inside, is not staying inside or hoarding food and water. It's collecting good family and growing a good strong relationship with God and connecting to the Earth. The sun can be darkened and the moon can refuse to shine 
But if you have God on your side, nothing is impossible and you will survive.